when I actually found out I had cancer, that was a Friday. And by Sunday, the world news had called my house wanting to know what statement I'd like to make because they found out I had cancer. So before I had called my friends, before I had even told Elton John that I had cancer, they were all reading it. At that point in my career, I was getting ready to do a video for the movie Chicago. And instead I had to make an appointment the next day for a biopsy. We pushed rehearsals for like a day and a half and then I had to go and shoot a video. Once I actually said it on the phone to Sean and it's malignant, that word, a floodgate came out. I collapsed to my knees and my mom just held me and all I could hear is my sister crying on the other end. Because all we thought was is it's over. It's done. I'll never forget being in my apartment when the call came in to what stage my cancer was. And it was early, it was not in the lymph nodes, but there are women out there that get the other answer. They don't have the support group and it just broke my heart that I was ready to go that extra mile and do it. And, um, and I got the answer most people want. And I'm, I'm grateful for it, but at the same time, I felt so guilty. What drives me to support Cancer Research UK? I want to try to help in any way I can because I'm still here and that's my job because I got through it, but n not all of us do and not all of us have the same story.